Canadian Special Operations Regiment CSOR. The Canadian Special Operations Regiment CSOR, is an elite unit of the Canadian Armed Forces. It forms part of the Canadian Special Operations Forces Command. As a special forces unit, the regiment's roles include conducting complex or difficult raids, capturing strategic facilities and undertaking reconnaissance. It is also capable of working with the armed forces of other countries. The unit traces its roots to the 1st Special Service Force FSSF, the Canadian-American Special Forces unit that was stood up in 1942 and earned the Devil's Brigade moniker for daring night raids on German forces at the Anzio beachhead. Seesaw perpetuates the battle honors of the FSSF. Recruiting for the new unit took place in early 2006, and the first CSOR selection course took place with approximately 175 candidates. On August 13, 2006, an official stand-up ceremony for the Canadian Special Operations Regiment took place at the unit's home station, Canadian Forces Base CFB, Petawawa, with approximately 250 soldiers participating. The ceremony included a skills demonstration including repelling from helicopters, and both static and freefall parachuting. It was also announced that the second training serial of CSOR recruits would take place in early 2007. The CSOR badge represents many aspects of the culture and history of the regiment. The V-42 stiletto is recognized as the fighting knife of the FSSF and links CSOR to allied American Special Forces organizations and is the main CANSOFCOM symbol. The crossed arrows signify friendship and are a direct link to the 1st Canadian Special Service Battalion, which is viewed as the founding Canadian Special Operation Forces Unit. Wreath defines the knowledge of special forces operators as educators and captures the unique role of CSOR as warrior diplomats and teachers of foreign forces. The wings signify swiftness, exemplified in the unit's readiness to undertake operations around the world. The motto, Aude Amos, translates to let us dare. It encapsulates that the regiment will accept any task and will step up to any challenge that comes its way. The regimental drink is whiskey and was chosen in recognition of the regiment's lineage to the FSSF. On December 5, 1943, while stationed in Italy and during the battle for Monte La Defensa, the FSSF went into a defensive posture once Monte La Defensa was secured. Colonel Robert T. Frederick, commander of the FSSF, directed his assistant commander, Colonel Paul Adams, to get 15 cases of whiskey to bolster the spirits of his soldiers. The men's rations were supplemented that night with whiskey which greatly improved morale. The regimental drink is used to welcome newly batched special forces operators to the regiment and during mess dinners in order to toast the regiment. The Canadian Special Operations Regiment was authorized the regimental standard by the Governor General, David Johnston, on April 15, 2015. Seesaw's regimental march is over the hills and far away, a traditional British folk song thought to date back to the 16th century and popularized during the Napoleonic Wars during the 1800s.
Under the auspices of the Anti-Crime Capacity Building Program of Global Affairs Canada, the Canadian Special Operations Regiment conducted training with both the Jamaican Defence Force and the Belizean Defence Force, culminating in Exercise Tropical Dagger. CSOR participates in Exercise Flintlock, a Special Operations Forces-focused exercise planned, coordinated and executed by African partner nations and sponsored by United States Africa Command. The regiment maintained a presence in Afghanistan from 2006 to 2014 in support of Canada's mission in Afghanistan. Canadian Special Operations Regiment also participates in the CANSOFCOM commitment to Operation Impact, the Canadian Armed Forces' support to the international military intervention against ISIL in Iraq and Syria. On 24 March 28, 2013, the Sea Sword placed third during the international competition that tests the counterterrorism skills of law enforcement and military units held at the King Abdullah II Special Operations Training Center in Amman. The competition included events testing skills in hostage rescue, aircraft assault, building entry and handling casualties. Shooting exercises were also included. Thirty-five units from 18 countries, including France, the US, Russia and the Netherlands, took part in the competition. The Canadian forces would not comment on the regiment's participation in the competition. But CSOR's involvement was mentioned in articles in the Jordan Times and Jane's Military Magazine. The Canadian Special Operations Regiment team leader was quoted in the Jordan Times as calling the competition fun, with the team winning five awards as well as third place in the overall results. In the execution of its mandate, CSOR personnel have been recognized for their operational excellence, such as receipt of the Star and Medals of Military Valor, Chief of Defense Staff Commendations, Mentions and Dispatches, Meritorious Service Decorations, among other honors and awards.